If you fast forward to today, it seems that all anyone can talk about is AI, especially here at TED, but you've taken a contrarian stance. You actually think AI is underhyped. Why is that? And I'll, t I'll tell you why. Most of you think of AI as, I'll just use the general term as ChatGPT. For most of you, ChatGPT was the moment where you said, oh my God, this thing writes, and it makes mistakes, but it's so brilliantly verbal. Right, that was certainly my reaction. Most mm -hmm. people that I knew did that. It was visceral, yeah. Um, this was two years ago. Since then, the gains in what is called reinforcement learning, which is what AlphaGo helped invent and so forth, allow us to do planning. And a good example is look at uh, OpenAI 03 or DeepSeek R1, and you can see how it goes forward and back, forward and back, forward and back. It's extraordinary. In my case, I bought a rocket company because it was like interesting. And I know- <laughs> As one does. As one does. And it's, it's an area that I'm not an expert in and I want to be an expert. So I'm using deep research. And these systems are spending 15 minutes writing these deep papers. It's true for most of them. Mm. Do you have any idea how much computation <laughs> 15 minutes of these supercomputers is? It's extraordinary. So you're seeing the arrival, the shift from language to language then you had language to sequence, which is how biology is done. Now you're doing essentially planning and strategy.